Blink Boys when you're watching PacWest TV right here at thepacwest.com from the campus of Concordia University at Irvine, where the Eagles are soaring high in their first year in the PacWest. It's game night in Irvine, and an old foe has come to town. Tonight, CU Arena is rocking as the Eagles take flight in front of an energetic home crowd filled with Concordia spirit. Point Loma is a rival from the old GSAC conference with both teams played as NAIA schools. But on this cool December evening, in CUI's first home conference game of the season, it's packed West bragging rights that are on the line. Sporting a 2-0 record at 7-1 overall, the Concordia men are already proving that they will be a force to be reckoned with for many years to come. In a league that loves the long ball, the Eagles can absolutely shoot lights out. Especially JT Roach, who poured in 27 points off the bench, including six three-pointers and five crucial free throws to deliver the victory for the team in white. En route to being named Pac West Player of the Week. But tonight, it was impossible to single out just one player or one coach or really anyone in the entire building. Because at Concordia, Eagle pride means everyone in this tight-knit, devout community contributes to the success of the program. One of the most dominant at the NAIA level. Assistant Athletic Director Mo Roberson understands the importance of keeping it that way as the Eagles ascend into the world of the NCAA. To try and build that uh, type of spirit uh, within our community. Uh, with our student athletes and our regular traditional students. So uh, we're very excited. Uh, it's good to have a small campus like that and uh, students living on campus to do that. So yeah, um, there's a lot of changes, paperwork, things like that, systems that we have to put in place, but it's making our institution, Concordia, overall a really uh, stronger institution. So we're really excited about that. And our, I think our student athletes, our students are enjoying the experience. That student-athlete experience is not limited to what's going on on the court, but it extends to the broader student community as well. Um, we're Screaming Eagles coordinators. We um, promote student involvement in athletic games, so we theme the games, ugly sweaters tonight, and we run the halftime games, so students have to tie these belts around their waist and shake their booties until all the jingle bells fall out, and then they win super cool prizes, and we get a lot of students at our games cheering Concordia on. What does it mean if you're a Screaming Eagle? What, do you, what does it mean to be a Screaming Eagle? We've got a lot of school spirit. You love Concordia, you love sports, you love Jesus, all of you love. <laughs> the Eagle program is 22 teams strong, and that means tremendous student athlete support for every sport. Tonight, the women's team made sure to stick around after their game to show their pride. Seniors Brittany Stafford and Tyler Crockham understand the challenges of moving into the Pac West and also the perks. It was really interesting. Um, I enjoyed it being on an island and never been there before. So me and my teammates really enjoyed the experience. It was a great experience. We didn't have the outcome that we really wanted, but just seeing Hawaii for the first time was very fun. I enjoyed both conferences in AI, GSAC, and PacWest, but um, I, do, I do enjoy being in the NCAA a lot more. Um, it's a lot more competitive play and I enjoy that. The area you might have seen the most spirit on display tonight was on the Eagles bench, where the 10 guys not on the court are just as involved in the game as the five between the lines. Well, it's like a tradition here at Concordia. The bench has to be involved in the game. We actually had like an article written about us uh, last year in Kansas City at Nashville. So yeah, we just like to get after it. What are the crazy things that your bench likes to do? Well, I mean like when people hit threes, we'll like shoot arrows or the, half the guys are on the court. So I'm surprised we haven't gotten in trouble for that, but we like to have fun down there. Concordia has been a successful place for many years, but now as members of Division II and the Pac West, it has set the bar higher and created the best experience you could have as a student athlete in the Eagle uniform. Yeah, well, we just got back from Hawaii last week, so that was awesome going out there. I mean, won two games out there, and then we had a tournament in Utah. So, you know, we've been going all around, and, you know, Concordia does a great job of taking care of us, making sure we have first-class travel and all that. So it's been great to see some new places. Concordia University, Irvine. Watch them soar.
in the Pack West. <laughs>